Widely regarded by fans as one of the sport's finest talents, extremely skilled Mexican master Ricardo Lopez amassed an incredible 51 victories, with an eye-watering 38 knockouts spanning his 16-year-long career. At the time, and he oh. hasn't looked back oh, since. What a there great goes. Goes. The time has come here. Boasting spectacular speed, undeniable power, and technical excellence, unbeatable Finito blasted his way through a record-breaking 22 defenses of the WBC title without ever tasting defeat, rightfully earning his place as one of Mexico's most revered champions. He's always on balance. Look at that. Oh, down he goes. There it is. Combination by Lopez. Always on balance, has the leverage. Oh. That's it. This oh. kid is gone. He is out. Forget about it. After almost 23 years since his last professional bout, we look back at the extraordinary skills of unbeatable Mexican boxing legend Ricardo Lopez. 26 fights into his professional career and ready for his first crack at world honors, Lopez took a trip to Japan to face off against newly crowned WBC title holder Hideyuki Ohashi. Making use of his nifty footwork, extremely sharp and proficient Lopez floored the champion with a thunderous two-punch combination two minutes into the fourth. <laughs> Startled by the Mexican speed and power, Ohashi was blasted to the canvas for a second time midway through the following round. Back to his feet but struggling to handle Ricardo's thudding power, Ohashi was swiftly wiped out with a crunching three-punch combination. Stumbling around the ring following the knockdown, Ohashi was saved from any further damage by referee Tony Perez, handing Ricardo his first world title victory inside 27 professional bouts. Almost two years on from his fifth round decimation of title holder Hideyuki Ohashi, Finito returned to Mexico to face off against Thai opponent Singh Preysen Kitakasem. Once again proving his excellence in technical proficiency, Lopez vanquished his challenger with a perfectly timed left hand two minutes into the fifth. The Mexican's exemplary timing was clear to see on the slow motion replays, brutally rewiring his opponent's senses with one perfectly timed punch. Returning to Japan to make the next defense of his WBC title, Lopez faced off against 14 fights unbeaten Rocky Lin. Successfully able to land his left hand from the get-go, Ricardo abruptly terminated his challenger with a murderous left hook midway through the second round. <laughs> Making quick work of his unbeaten opponent, Finito had added another spectacular one-punch finish to his rapidly growing collection of impressive highlight reel knockout finishes. Back in Mexico, and now making the sixth defense of his WBC minimum weight strap, Lopez clashed against 15-1 opponent Sama Soja Tarang. Boxing on the back foot behind a range-finding left jab, Lopez walked his challenger onto a picture-perfect right hand in the closing seconds of the opening round. <laughs> Struggling to avoid the Mexicans' crisp attacks, Sorja Tarang was floored again following a four-punch flurry at the midway point of the following frame. Able to land his punishing blows with ease, Finito terminated his Thai challenger with a sense-scrambling salvo in the final seconds of the second. Handing out another one-sided beating, Ricardo improved his record to 34 wins without defeat. Fighting on the undercard of Mike Tyson versus Frank Bruno, Lopez took on big punching Philippine southpaw Ala Villamor. Okay, this front's a little high. 
Okay, Ben. Okay, shake hands. Good luck. Picking up arguably his most impressive one-punch finish to date, Ricardo surgically dissected the Philippine with a discombobulating left uppercut in the eighth. At the time. And he oh. hasn't looked back. Oh, what a there great he goes. uppercut. The time has come here. What a great oh. uppercut. Flat on his back and struggling to regain his senses, sprawled out Villa Moore was counted out by referee Joe Cortez. Victory for Ricardo Lopez as he knocks out Ala Villa Moore here in round number eight. The knockout loss would be Villamore's final professional bout, opting to retire from the sport at just 26 years of age. Looking to squeeze in another defense just three months on from his obliteration of a la Villamore, Ricardo took a trip to Indio, California to do battle against 21-year-old challenger Kitachai Precha. Ranked number nine in the WBC rankings, Precha was cleaned out with a brain-rattling three-punch salvo in the third. You, know, you watch Lopez when he moves offensively and defensively. He's always on balance. Look at that. Oh, there he goes. There it is. Combination by Lopez. Always on balance, has the leverage. Oh. That's it. This oh. kid is gone. He is out. Forget about it. Round three, it's over. Once again, putting his incredible speed and power to use, Lopez had destroyed another challenger with a chilling highlight reel finish. Six months on from his third-round demolition of Kitachai Precha, Finito took on South Korean champion Myung Sub Park. All right, any questions? Good luck, come out boxing. Eager to make quick work of his overmatched opponent, Big Punching Lopez planted Park on the seat of his pants with a vicious left hook two minutes into the opening. I don't think I've ever seen him go after a guy that's fast. Whoa. Well, swing the miss, but a left floors the challenger Park. A straight ball. left. A little bit of a hook into it. Six. This fight's over, fellas. This fight is over. Oh, -E a bloody Myung Sub Park staggers to his feet. Surprisingly allowed to continue after such a heavy knockdown, Park was swiftly stopped on his feet by referee Chuck Hassett following Finito's vicious ensuing attack. A left cut, a combination, and that's it. Chuck Hassett steps in, and it's over in round one. It was another punch perfect showing from the unbeaten Mexican star stopping his highly ranked opponent with just over two minutes on the clock of the opening round. Fighting on the undercard of a bill topped by unbeaten Puerto Rican star Felix Trinidad, Finito took on WBO title holder Alex Sanchez. We went over the rules by both organizations earlier. I expect you to obey these rules. Let's have a nice clean fight. Hooks, gloves, good luck to the both of you. Opting to pressure lankier Lopez, Sanchez was blasted to the canvas for the first time in his career with a counter right hand one minute into the second stanza. I would say better or as good. Oh, oh there he goes. Straight right hand, and down goes Sanchez. Come on. Alex Sanchez down for the Five, first time in his career. Six. Somehow able to survive Finito's onslaught in the second, Sanchez was picked apart over the following three rounds, eventually hitting the canvas for the second time following a concussive six-punch combination in the closing stages of the fifth. Ricardo Lopez is no nonsense. This is not just boxing. This is making a statement. Left cut off the combination, and down goes Sanchez again for the second time of the fight. Four. Still staggering and stumbling after climbing back to his feet, Sanchez was saved from any further punishment by referee Arthur Mercante Jr., forcing the Puerto Rican to part way with his WBO strap. Taking part in the penultimate fight of his incredible career, IBF champion Lopez took on power-punching southpaw Ratana Paul Vorapin. former IBF mini flyweight champion of the world, Ratana Paul Vorapin. Seemingly rocked and disoriented from a sharp left uppercut one minute into the third, stumbling southpaw Vorapine was stopped on his feet following a vicious barrage mere moments later. Christy Martin got the early knockout. William Daffy got a relatively easy knockout. And Ricardo Lopez has Ratanapa Vorapine going against the ropes. I think Vorapine, who originally was a kickboxer, needs to do some kicking, otherwise he's out of here. And he's out of here now. Richard Steele seeing enough. Finito picked up the 50th consecutive victory of his incredible punch-perfect career. The Mexican would go on to have one more win before retiring from the sport at the age of 34, becoming the third-ever world champion to retire with his unbeaten record firmly intact.